Mr. So James should be out anytime soon by now. Uh, it has really been a long day. It's so tired. Yes, I understand. You have a really tough job, Dr. Shikongo. Quick question, Dr. Shikongo. Mm -hmm. Why don't you open up your own medical private clinic? Um, I wish I could do that, but when I'm in a hospital, I feel so close to my mom. She died the day that I was born. Let's go! Let's go! More! More. Baby's coming! Good girl! Good girl! Yay! Because of the lack of equipment and labor, I feel like my my desire right now is to help women who are giving birth um, at the hospital. And yeah, because when, when my mom passed on, there was no enough uh, tools and labor, like people who can help her to give, to give birth. So I want to be that person there. And I actually enjoy being at the hospital. Honey, I'm home. Afternoon, I bring myself in paperwork. You love to bring your your hospital. Well, it's kind of better when having a whole meeting with you and. <laughs> you still got that sense of humor, huh? <laughs> the kids ate already. I didn't want to keep them for too long. And I didn't even see them today. I hope that I know that I tried. Coming back home as early as possible. Do you know their father worked hard? Yes, their father works hard. Driving a rich man around that comes back home early. Um, honey, mm -hmm. did you book the lot of tickets? I can't wait to see the Serbian place. This would be one of the last place can you imagine. Yeah, it's sorted. We yeah, are playing out on Monday. And I can't wait to be there. It's so fantastic. And secondly, I have to deliver goods to rich people's houses because they can't even do anything for themselves. It's an honest living. I have to drive to Elisa and him today to go deliver goods for Mr. James. Looking at those houses, I still can't believe people live like that. Are you listening to me, baby? Yes, um, yeah, this reminds me. Did you speak to the tailor lady? I just saw? Yeah, I did. Mm-hmm. Why? I hope it's ready to be ready on Saturday, because remember we had that uh, hospital charity? It would be really lovely if you could donate something there. Honey, it sounds very nice. But, it's, uh, it's lovely to help people when you need. That sounds really nice. But well, is it okay we set it off a little later? I have to tell you something. I'm pregnant. Lady, be serious. We don't have money for this. Huh? You can't be happy like that. My love, a child is a blessing from God. But not when you have two children and no money to take care of them. We need to think logically. You know what? I'm done with this. Let me go get ready for my job. Nonsense.
Lord, why would you do this to me? We are struggling. Take this baby away from me. Save this baby from this poverty. So it's a, I got a call from the hospital. They told me my wife was admitted into the hospital and they want me to pay a, a bill of 20,000 Namibian dollars, sir. 20,000 Namibian dollars? Yes, sir. If I may ask, why was she admitted into the hospital? My wife is pregnant and she tried to kill the baby inside the belly. That's horrible. No, really. I'll send you the money immediately to your account. I'll be thankful, sir. Yeah, don't take me now. Just go. Why is that? Exactly. Very safe, my dear. 